Hello everyone, this is your energy update for this week, the 7th of September until the 13th. Here in South Africa, in the Southern Hemisphere, we're really feeling spring coming. We see the flowers blooming, the animals getting excited for the warmth. Although my wolves love the cold and they always get more excited with the cold. But uh, you can hear the birds chirping and this idea of a new beginning. So, but for us all, I asked the angels to guide us through this week. And I actually chose cards from both of my sets. The first one, first cards that I'm going to share is from my Archangel set, Ask the Archangels. And this is Archangel Galadriel coming through and Archangel Bismail. Galadriel and Bismail bring the messages of masculine and of nature. So the masculine energy that we need to incorporate this week is all about decision making, um, reordering that mind, start deciding that you want to use your mind positively and be very aware of when you slip down that rabbit hole of negativity and you go back into all belief systems. Today on Monday is really a day where you can just stretch and cross those boundaries that you haven't been able to cross before. After the new moon and full moon, everything is ready for us to make new decisions, to really transcend the old way of thinking and doing. So then you will also see that situations pop out that come and push that button. This week it might be in relationships. that just pushes you to put the past behind you and to allow healing. And you'll see in the other cards as well that there's much to do about healing this week. Um, but the nature is also about the healing, going to nature, allow, reflect. You will see this week you need to be guided by your own, your own wisdom. It is a week to gather knowledge as well, but gather your own wisdom as you push forward. This is a week for doing. It's a week to take action, to put energy into projects, get excited about projects, but also be honest with yourself as to what needs to just go. What can't you focus on right now? Don't try and put too much pressure on yourself to get everything done and then, then get overwhelmed and get nothing done. Another two cards from my Ask the Archangel cards is Nephil, the boundaries. So she's telling us, of course, boundaries is also putting up your boundaries and sticking to them. But it's also push past boundaries that has been holding you back in your way of thinking, in what you believe for yourself and in those old belief systems that I'm constantly hammering about. And then Ashmodel, Archangel Ashmodel, she's asking us to be flexible. So balance yourself between doing Balance is key with this week. Balance yourself between doing, creating. Remember that doing needs to be creative in order to, all, to be healing. In order to also be healing. Because that is what we need this week. And this is why if you don't find it in your work, there's not enough creativity in. Just take some time. Go out in nature and allow the sun to shine on you. And just that flow of energy to be rejuvenated. Now, from my Ask the Angel cards this week, I drew Tim Miller that says you are unique and Nashella, ponder and grow. Now, the uniqueness comes in with the creativity and the projects that you choose to do this week. To really focus on what makes sense to you, what feels right now, receive guidance. This is also a very spiritual week and a week to focus on where your spirituality is grounded upon. What is your foundation? And if you feel that you don't have a foundation, then you need to start redefining what you believe in, what you trust for yourself and life and how you are being taken care of by spirit in the whole. So, and then ponder and grow is very much about Take the wisdom from the past, leave behind what needs to stay in the past and grow from it. Contribute to yourself, um, 
just invest in your own spirituality, in time for your own spirituality, for your body, for self-care, and also in the decision that you're making. So it's on very many levels this week, but they actually all come together to say, just do what you need to do, be aware of strain on your relationships, and choose the higher path of love and healing, which you will see by Sunday will come in. But try and choose it during the week as well, while there is upheaval. And then, you know, commit to those actions and really do it out of the joy of being the new you, in trusting and that fulfillment for yourself. And then find the balance in nature and harmony within the beauty of what is available to you in your surroundings. So that's it for this week. I did place a new meditation on YouTube on my channel, Angel Messages. Uh, it is a meditation to prepare you for September with Archangel Gabriel. It will help you to relax nicely, invite your own presence, be aware of your own presence and who you are, and just to calm down and just enjoy who you are as a spiritual being. So take it, lots of love and blessing from me. Uh, we do have a busy week ahead of us, but just keep that structure going, keep the balance going, and you will be able to enjoy it. Take care. Bye.